Welcome to Sinister Terminal Sewers. Now, I'm going through a lot of different videos within the first... There's darn... darn set of videos. But we have... I've also seen some videos on this one, like Five Nights at Yoshi's. Ready then. I'll stay silent for this intro cutscene. I'll turn off the microphone as well. There was meant to be leftover supplies. I know I saw them. You know, I remember hearing you say that shit to me no less than 15 hours ago. And I remember hoping, fucking praying, for you to be right. They didn't believe you, and yet they still went through with the plan because I stuck my neck out for you. But wouldn't you fucking know it, that damned spinning dino was completely bone dry. Now not only are we low on resources, but now those people are trapped there since the main stage area is being scoped all the goddamn time by those THINGS! You know, I'm going against my better judgment by not throwing you out of this room and leaving you for those things. Ah, what the hell am I supposed to do with you, Warden? You ain't giving me a lot of breathing room. We're still gonna try and help them, right? Well, of course we are. But you can't deny our options are limited. Funhouse has been a no-go for weeks now, and all the routes out of the pirate's den were blocked for our safety. Which only leaves one realistic choice, but... Where do I have to go? Out between the gift shop strip and the entrance to the den is a maintenance shed with a map of all nearby entrances to the sewer system. Now we can't use it as a direct exit since the pathway to the pumping station off-site's blocked off. Though, even if it weren't, it'd be too far of a walk. But, we can use it as a tunneling system to get around the park, without having to mind Banjo Billy and his rambling rascals. Right. And that was the plan. Though Grace never came back to tell us it was safe. Honestly, we have no idea what's down there. Whatever it is, it can't be any worse than what's up here. You know, it wouldn't be very responsible of me to let anyone risk their lives while we're already down so many people. But, that won't stop you, will it? I have to be the one to go. It'd be better if I apologized face to face. Well, in that case, don't let me stop you. Oh, and, uh, in that shed should also be some of your little projects. Those little tinker toys along with the second half of this walkie set. You take what you need. We'll talk when you're down there. If there's anything down there, you gotta get out of there. You understand me? Alright, so we're beginning. Barely. Signals are bad enough around here as is. Being underground doesn't help. Then I'll be quick about it. Since the lot's been faded for who knows how long, I assume the overflow pipes down there are so old and the fog is garbage, they won't be able to operate this place for anything. Slug. So, if you can force this local flushing valve, you can shut should be able to flood a whole section of the sewers in a matter of a few minutes. Doing that will guarantee that nothing's down there, and whatever was down there would either break down or ground. How do you know the sewers will start to flood? And where do I even go to do all that? The supplies left down there by the previous sanitation department should be enough to get the job done. Burning pipes here, clogged up maybe there. 
Once that's done, we can use the root of the perfectly safe tunnel to travel without having to deal with anything upstairs. Got all that? I sure hope so. We'll know the job is done when it starts smelling even worse up there than normal. All right, Warren, I'm putting a lot of faith in you. Don't fuck this up. Thank fuck. you. So I guess we're starting. I get bright enough, but I don't really need my flashlight, but I will have it on just in case. We need it. So the map's being mapped out, so the whole thing would be mapped out for me. I don't know what this thing is. I don't have anything. Is this a tuna can. Why oh, do I need a tuna? It's a control again. There is a controls key, right?
I want someone to make an APC pack for this. I want someone to make an NPC pack for Gary's mod to like add Mangle and Cupcake into Gary's mod so like we can have them like roaming around and even I'll even showcase them in a sewer map. Yeah, my map resets every time I die. So that's brilliant. Throw this over here. Yep. I hope I don't run into her. Like, I hope. I know one instance she's just gonna just like pop up suddenly. Even when I'm not even looking. Oh wait, that's just that's just the light. Kind of panics there a bit. Like I should try and map out much, as much of the area as I can. Yar. All right. Like my stance, my whole rule. Like sometimes my lean key don't work. Let's play. No, we don't play. Like I will carry one just to see if if I throw one at her, it slows her down. No way. You know what? Here, have have a tuna can. From what I've known, just stare at the cupcake and it won't, won't move that much. Like, it shouldn't move, be able to move as long as I'm staring at it. Is it still following me? No, I gotta wait for it. No. Where is she coming? <gasps> oh! The, the cupcake! You got in the way! Cut in the way. Oh, that's a dead end. I want to see where this goes. You can go off if you want to. I gotta come out. I had to come out or else I would die. Not away from her. From my angle, please, Zach. Where's the, the uh, wrenches? I need a wrench. I did think I saw the cupcake. I don't know. Like, the cupcake can't kill me, but Mangle and Wires and Browning can. Wow. 
can also do like uh, a bit of an experiment video where I can experiment with Mangle's AI. Feel free to like send me links and compl compliments and such. Oh my goodness. She's gonna see me watch, I'm gonna call her. <gasps> oh! How did Mangle not get me? Electrical wedge. I know what this is for. It's for uh, dealing with the uh, electric exposed wire. Oh, there. Okay, okay. Okay, very funny, very funny. The sneaking up behind me. Very, very funny. I'm gonna follow this. Hopefully, this takes me to where I'm meant to go. Because this is the blue one. Ah. Okay, time to find something to activate the pumps. Here, just take that. That's very funny. You won't see me, right? <laughs> yep, I knew it! I knew it! And just for the record, I'm not editing this, this is actually going real time. Like if I can get the cupcake here, I can lure a mangle here, so I'm just gonna throw this to hopefully alert her. The cupcake. But I can only mean if I'm looking at an object, but other times I can. I, so I'll let her go, the cupcake go off. Hi. She just backs off. Go off, cupcake. Go to hell, you big pile of shit. Oh! Come, come charging you though. Oh my goodness. 
The game's just rubbing that in my face. The game's rubbing that in my face. Good job. You've died a total of 999 times. The game's just rubbing that in my face. Tell me how many times I've died. So this is the green pipe. Like way. I'll go quickly to the, uh, the uh, there. Okay, so this is the green. Okay, game. time to find something to activate the pumps. I don't know where the cupcake's at though. Where is the cupcake? I'm pretty sure that's the same good job sign. Can we also mention those physics? Oh, there he is. Running that way, I can get this place is quicker. I need to cover more of the layout, and oh my goodness, this place is huge. Flashlight, the flashlight temporarily decided to give up on me. Thank you. Also counts as a hidey goal. Like, I hope I'm going the right way. Uh, yep, this is the right way. See, right up there. Is he looking at me? Can't tell if he's looking at me, but you can throw this up at him. One of the object acts. Here, hold this. I hope the cupcake ain't there. I hope. Wait, the mangle? Oh. So like, hi there. Hi. <laughs> I 
Triangle, go away! Does it look like I want to be having any revenges? That's a bad throw. <gasps> oh my goodness, I've never had that happen. My heart is actually beating from that surprise. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching and bye bye! I'll also adjust the quality more down so I can actually work a bit more effectively on the form of the subject. Bye bye!